Any tips before I go in? Blink. Blink. She hates when people don't blink, it weirds her out. Hi, Jules. I'm Ben, your new intern. I'm glad you also see the humor in this. Be hard not to. Nancy sent me the script and, uh, and, and offered me the part of Ben, and I read it, and I, and I, and I liked it, and I, I wasn't thinking that I wouldn't like it, and I, uh, she, <clears throat> I knew also that she's very particular, so if she sent it to me, she did a lot of thinking about it, and, this, and that, made, that comforted me, knowing that you know, this was a real offer, it wasn't a, a, um, wasn't a, a, a simple decision for her, so that was good for me. And um, uh, when I got sent the, the script, um, it was to audition for the part. Bob was already attached to, uh, to star in it. And I just loved what I was reading. I thought it was a very unusual script to get nowadays, um, something that's heartfelt and about you know, an unlikely friendship and the importance of, of not judging people. And there were so many things about it that I found really sweet and endearing. And, um, and I'd always wanted to work with Nancy, of course. I'd always wanted to work with Bob. So for me, it was a fairly easy decision. Our investors just think that a seasoned CEO could take some things off your plate. I did not see that coming. She's just trying to do right by everybody. The company, the family. The pressure was unbelievable. You started this business all by yourself a year and a half ago, and now you have a staff of 220 people. Remember who did that? Um, compassionate, wise, fun. It's exciting. I mean, it's... Uh, when I heard a statistic recently that bummed me out, which was that uh, th only 30% of speaking roles in movies go to women, as opposed to 70% that go to men. Um, so anything that can be done to get that number up, and if by having, I don't know, better, stronger, more widely seen uh, female characters, I think that's for the, for the benefit of everybody. Except for that 20% of guys who aren't going to get the speaking parts <laughs> now. I think it's interesting because also Nancy's, uh, her life has evolved at the same speed. You know, the type of character she was writing 30 years ago, um, uh, women's place in the world is very different than what it is now. I think that must be very interesting for her to be, to be able to chart that with her writing. I tried yoga, learned to cook, bought some plants, took classes in Mandarin. Believe me, I've tried everything. I just know there's a hole in my life and I need to fill it soon. Mandarin sure keeps busy. Mr. Congeniality. Everybody loves him. You should dress to impress. Tuck in the shirt. Why doesn't anybody tuck anything in anymore? Oh, I'm asking you. No, well, actually, I was trying to get all these kids to be part of my, uh, my <laughs> gang, my mafia gang. And uh, I asked Annie and I asked the director uh, if I could maybe beat some kids or make some. I was a fan some, of it. I was, some, I was uh, on your side. But uh, they wouldn't let me go Nancy that way. Nancy wanted to make the film that she wrote. Yeah, so I, I had to respect that. And I just, yeah. okay. Good time. <laughs> It's moments like this when you need someone you know you can count on because you're my... Intern. Well, I was going to say intern slash best friend. Yeah, very are. professional and uh, to start, very much about the work. And then as it went on, things warmed up and, and I, had a, I had a wonderful time. Yeah, we both did. Super positive experience. So you're on Facebook, huh? I joined about 10 minutes ago. <laughs> Well, better late than never. All right, so there are all these questions for your profile that you can answer if you want to, like people who inspire you. Jules Austin. <sighs> you do inspire Jules. Well, I like the message of, of the ad. I don't know what it translates to in other languages. What is it? Exper Experience never gets old. Experience never gets old. I, I think that's uh, important. I don't know what that would translate into in French or in Italian or... Or even over here. Here she comes. Hey, Beck, what's up? You look really nice. And how long can a woman be mad at you for? I assume you talked to her, apologized. I emailed her. Subject line, I wrote, I'm sorry, with like a ton of O's. So I was like, I'm sorry. With a sad emoticon where he's crying. It was a very serious shoot. <laughs> um, yeah. there, we had a lot of work to do and a limited amount of time to do it. So, um, you know, sometimes there would be dance parties on set. We had an adorable five-year-old who plays my daughter in the film who's obsessed with the movie Frozen. So um, we could make her smile by, like, if she was getting kind of bored in a scene, we would just play Let It Go. So, like, little things like that. They're not really funny, though. They're more charming. How in one generation have men gone from guys like Jack Nicholson and Harrison Ford to... Oh, boy. I'm Pete 
Fiona, the house masseuse. Love that there's another oldie but goodie here. <laughs> How's that been? Well, it's that old boy. Here you go. You're not as old as I thought you were. Ooh.